Kowasco. I'd like to welcome you to spiritandart.org, the website that tries to answer the question, what is spirit and art? I'm going to take a couple minutes here and share a brief story as well about the experience I had back in the 1980s that inspired me to create this website. It was 1984 and I was attending the college, Rudolf Steiner College, in Fair Oaks, studying about the form out of color school that Rudolf Steiner created back in the turn of the 20th century. Rudolf Steiner was a philosopher, a scientist, a doctor, clairvoyant, created the Waldorf school system, as well as a technique and a movement in creating art that's alive that's called Out of the Color. It was at that college in the 80s that I met Malsby Kimball, the well-known, renowned form out of color artist who was a teacher at the college. And we instantly became friends and became my teacher and mentor. And Malsby had said that they're having an exhibit at the LA Art Museum called Spirit and Art and Abstract Painting. He said, you gotta go there. Let's see what Spirit and Art is like. I'm at the college producing paintings like this one that I've got on the right and paintings that like I have all through my website with other artists that I really wanted to see what the LA Art Museum had to offer. So here I go down to the LA Art Museum. I'm sitting in the introduction chamber that seats about 20 people and up on the wall pops a picture of Rudolf Steiner, eight by 10 feet high. I was just surprised. I did not expect to see a picture of Rudolf Steiner. I had just come from the college in Sacramento, and here they're explaining that Rudolf Steiner was one of the main inspirations to Mondrian, Kandinsky, and Franz Marc, who were the fathers of modern art. Painting at that particular time of Steiner had come to the Impressionists and had stopped. These men wanted to know what lies behind the physical world and speaks to the human soul and spirit and it was that that was recommended to see Dr. Steiner to talk to him and he inspired them to start the movement of modern art. But the form out of color school was something that had not been really heard of. So I go through the rest of this exhibit here expecting to see things that are alive and colorful like some of this form out of the color work and I was disappointed. And at the very end, I'm standing in a corridor, and here at the very end of this corridor is a painting that I couldn't tell which side was up, and it was glimmering and shining. And I walk up to the bottom, and there's a plaque, like ingredients in a cake mix, that says inside this painting is composed of dust, dirt, AM, FM radio parts, and fragments from a human skull. <laughs> Well, I'm thinking, wait a minute, Rudolf Steiner, form out of color, spirit and art, crushed fragments from a human skull, AM, FM radio part, something's missing here. <laughs> so it was out of that initiative that I felt that I think we needed a website to be able to communicate this whole school of form out of color that Rudolf Steiner created, that Malsby Kimball, among a whole group of artists have been working out of since the turn of the 20th century. So that's what we've got here in the website is a, a place to one connect with for an educational and cultural center to find out about initiatives working out of the spirit and art impulse, architecture, dance, paintings, have paintings for sale in the gallery with Malsby Kimball and any number of other artists in a chat room called Adamo, in touch with the arts, and you can connect on that and be able to uh, dialogue and talk to anybody that you might want to like to talk to about what is the answer to what is spirit in art, as well as a, a connecting uh, space to be able to email anything that you might want to communicate with or purchase any of the art or be a part of this initiative and movement. And also, in closing, I'd like to say I still like to talk to people, so there'll be a phone number down there that you can call to be able to uh, 
to share any ideas and thoughts and questions. So I hope that in some way gives you a small introduction to what you are about to experience in this website. Thank you for coming, and I hope you enjoy the journey. Thank you.